Hi everyone, this is Miss Hauk here with your Mighty Minutes today. Today we are going to explore shapes and different ways to make them using our fingers, our hands, and you can even practice later on making shapes with your body. So we are going to start by singing a little tune and drawing shapes in the air with our finger. And it says, I can make a circle. So it goes, Miss Hout can make a circle. Miss Hout can make a circle. Can you make a circle just like this? And you go around, you can do a little circle. Or you can do a big circle. It's round. If you look at my shape chart, the circle has zero sides and zero vertices. It is round. Miss Hout can make a square. Miss Hout can make a square. Can you make a square just like this? So you're gonna do over, down, over, up. All four sides are just alike. There is the square on my paper. It's the blue one, a square. Can you boys and girls draw a square in the air? Down, over, up, over. Four sides that are all the same sides is a square. Miss Hout can make a triangle. Miss Hout can make a triangle. Can you make a triangle just like this triangle? One long, short, long, short. Do it again, long, short, long, short. That's right, if you look at my chart, the rectangle is the brown shape. A rectangle has two long sides and two short sides. Two long and two short. Make a rectangle. Say that shape name, rectangle. So a rectangle and a square both have four sides. But remember, if it has too long and too short, then it's the rectangle. Good practicing drawing it in the air. Next, we're going to do another one. Miss Hout can make a triangle. Miss Hout can make a triangle. Can you make a triangle just like this? Down, over, up. So it's two diagonal lines down, over, up, down, over, up. So there are three sides, one, two, three, in a triangle, and there's also three vertices. Those are the points, one, two, three. So if you see a shape that has three sides, it is a what, everyone? That's right, it's a triangle. Triangles have three sides. Stay with me, we're gonna do um, one more. And then we're going to practice using our hands to make one instead of drawing with our finger. So get your pointer finger ready. It says, Miss Hout can make an oval. Miss Hout can make an oval. Can you make an oval just like this? Here's the oval. It is a stretched out circle. See it? It has zero sides. See, it doesn't have any of those sides and zero points or vertices. So the circle is round like a ball and an oval is long and stretched out like an egg. The egg shape is an oval. Oval and circle are kind of the same. So you have to look really careful. So if it's more like a ball, then it's the circle. If it's more like an egg, then it's the oval. So next we are going to look at the circle. So we're going to make a circle in the air using our hands. So the way that you do that, boys and girls, is hold your hand up like this. You can make a circle. Or you can just make a little one like this. Circle. See it? Round. Zero sides. Next, we can make a triangle. Remember, the triangle is a shape that has three sides. And the way you do that with your hands is you can take your pointer finger like this. And then take your two, number two, or your bunny ears, and put it on top of your pointer finger. And boys and girls, you have the triangle. Three sides is a triangle. Can you see it? You try it. 
All right, I'm gonna show you another one. We practiced this one last week. This was the heart shape. This one's kind of tricky to make a heart. You're gonna put your two thumbs together and you're gonna scrunch your fingertips and you're gonna touch fingernails to fingernails, fingernails to fingernails. So all your fingernails are touching and your thumbs are pointing down and you have a heart. I love you. Heart means love. There it is, up high, to the side, to the other side. Heart, boom, 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 yep. All right, the next one we can make with our hand is the diamond. So for the diamond, we're gonna take two fingers on this side, two fingers on the other side. You're gonna flip them and put them together and turn and look. You have a diamond. And that's one that we didn't think about, but we know the diamond looks like two triangles put together. The diamond. And if you look, the diamond is purple on my page right here. Diamond. The diamond is like a square because it has four sides and it has four vertices. But see, it is turned. Diamond. Oops, sorry, I'm wiggling that. So you can go home and talk with your family and you can practice making shapes with drawing in the air, making them with your fingers, or you can use your whole body, boys and girls, but if you use your body to make shapes like a circle, you can maybe do one, but some of the shapes that have more than one side, you may need to ask them your family members to help. Happy learning. Bye, friends.